Suppose a four or five year old, large headed, bright blue eyed boy is subject to taking cold, and every cold settles in the head giving him a flushed face and throbbing carotids. You give him belladonna which relieves but doesn't act deeply enough to cure. He continues to have headaches but after a while Bell will not relieve them. Upon a thorough study of the case you find that when his symptoms are not acute, when he does not have this cold and fever. He does not have the headache and you see an entirely different remedy indicated. You study over the flabby muscles, and you find his glands are enlarged. He takes cold with every change in the weather, and he craves eggs. Then you decide that the case calls for calcarea carb. The fact that Belladonna was so closely related to him and only acted as a palliative further emphasizes the remedy selection. It is a loss of time to treat more than the first or second acute paroxysm. Don't give the complimentary calcarea carb during the paroxysm, but only after the edge has been smoothed by Belladonna.